Hey, I'm Lucretia Renee Church. This is 3 Minute Matters, and I am here to encourage you from a biblical perspective within three minutes. Here's a word for you. Never stop reaching. Let's go. I've come to tell you that in this season of your life, you're going to have to reach, to stretch yourself. To reach is to extend or to stretch out. It's to elongate yourself in order to grab something. Now, I know that you're already doing a lot and you may feel that you're too exhausted and you can't muster up the strength to do anything else, not one other thing. But let me tell you something. Please hear me. You are going to have to stretch your faith. Your blessing is within your ability to reach. It's an arm's length away. You'll attain it as you lift your hands and you praise God in the midst of unfavorable situations. You'll grab a hold of it when you give yourself past what's normal. When you fast in the time of feast in order to develop a deeper relationship with Jesus, I declare to you that your next breakthrough is in your reach. It's within your willingness to believe the ridiculous and obey the uncommon instruction of God without question. For some, a reach may be as simple as a bend of the knee and extend of the hand. And for others, it may be a strenuous lean forward. But no matter the level of of intensity in the move just reach for it you may not know it but that person that's in the nail salon or in the barbershop needs you to stretch they need you to reach out of your comfort zone in order to tell them the good news of the gospel so that they can make it just one more day there are many people who had to stretch themselves in order to get the miracle Moses stretched out his staff over the sea and it parted Elijah stretched himself himself over the dead child and he was brought back to life. The man in the New Testament stretched out his withered hand and it was healed. And we all know that Jesus was stretched. There is a blessing in the stretching. When each of us, with each waking day of our lives, stretch ourselves, we reach for the greater in God. And though we may have achieved remarkable things thus far, there's always more to grasp. Don't let fear, doubt, weariness, or any of that hold you back. And remember that the word of God tells us in Philippians 4 and 13, we can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. When we extend ourselves, he helps us. And when we expand ourselves, he empowers us. And when we stretch ourselves, he provides strength. Go ahead, reach. Thanks for joining me. Leave me a message and be sure to share this message. And let's do it again next week on 3 Minute Matters.